Okay then everyone, so we're back playing some Dragon Age Origins. So, let's talk Vienna, to the captain of the guard. I'm bid to let you walk the commons, but keep your place. Warden or not, I want order. The blight is coming and I need Orzmar's assistance. Surface problems. Well, we have no king to hear you. You can join the shouting at the assembly in the diamond quarter if you want. Bunch of Desher lords bickering over sand. Balin, Aromont. Is one so different? No paragons here. I should get going. Yes, you should. Okay. Wow. So this is Orzammar. It's huge. Okay. Hang on a moment. Uh, so to the diamond quarter we're gonna go then. Man, I mean, this LP, I mean, just looking at the date today, this LP has been going on for about 16 months. Nearly 16 months, this LP, I've been recording it. Definitely need to get a move on with this LP. Don't want, I don't want it to last too long, as in, like, I don't want it to have been up for so long, because <laughs> it has been. Uh, I haven't really had much commitment recently as well, which is terrible for a YouTuber. I certainly did have the bad luck of having a few holidays snatched away from me sort of thing so I mean definitely been short for time but hopefully soon I'll have the chance to finish it all we'll see you know with Dragon Age Inquisition releasing very soon it's gonna be a uh, nice to get a move on because I still need to do Dragon Age Awakening and Dragon Age 2 before I can do that okay Do the right place. The assembly is in session. Your mind has gone to dust if you think we would pass it or it. Half our houses would go broke without the service trade. The proposal is only effective until we have a king to ensure we are respected by the surfacers. Leaving you conveniently positioned to take over all contracts. I'll see your head on a pike first. Geshers, lords and ladies of the assembly. I've already doubled the guard to prevent violence. Must I summon more? Steward Bandalore, Balin's sympathizers are tying our hands with trivialities. They may as well open us to the sky. I suggest we put the matter to a vote. And I suggest you have a taste of my family's mace. Enough. The assembly is in recess until the members can regain control of their emotions. Forsaken fools and dusters. I'm sorry. This is the assembly of the clans. Only dashers and occasional guests of state are allowed in. You don't recognize a Grey Warden? Forgive me. I am so exhausted. I completely forgot about the message from the Gate Guard. Welcome to Orzammar, Warden. I hope you can forgive our unrest. The loss of our kin has hit us hard. Respect for your role is great. But you won't receive a proper hearing until we have a king on the throne. Uh, is any way I can break this stalemate? I must admit, Warden, I am at a loss myself. It lies with Prince Balin or Lord Harrimont, and they are slow to trust anyone in these uncertain times. Doolin Verender, Harrimont's man, can be found at the Harrimont estate. Varteg Gavorn, Prince Balin's second, is often here in the assembly. I only wish there was more I could do for you. Okay. Uh, I think Haramont sounds like a nicer guy than Balin. You know, uh, so we probably want to find someone to do with Haramont. I heard there was a Grey Warden here. I am Doolin Forender, second to Lord Haramont. King Endrin's own choice as successor. Word is spreading that the surface may suffer a blight. It is shameful we are not in a better position to help. 
I have a treaty obliging Orzmar to aid against the Blight. That may be, and that is a terrible risk for the service. But even if the world would end tomorrow, Lord Harrowmont cannot ignore Balin today. He cannot afford to trust anyone of unproven loyalties. What do you want me to do? Denounce Balin publicly? If you wish to show you have no loyalty to Balin, then work against him in Harrowmont's name. Balin is hosting a proving today, supposedly to honor his father's memory. The Deshers take it very seriously, and unfortunately, Balin found some way to blackmail or intimidate House Harrowmont's best fighters into stepping down. Why would your assembly care who wins some tournament? Proving is a contest of the best warriors in Orzammar. By fighting, they show who has the ancestors' favor. If you were to enter the Proving as Lord Harrowmont's champion, it would prove your loyalty beyond a doubt. Balin would never work with anyone who humiliated him in that way. Harrowmont would have no fear of meeting with you then. Um... I'll enter the Proving and see why the others withdrew. Excellent. The arena is located off the Commons. Talk to the Proving Master and tell him you're entering Lord Harrowmont's roster. The key fighters we lost were Guidon and Beisel. You can look for them in the fighters' preparation chambers behind the ring. And be sure it's before the fights begin. After the first bout, no one may change the roster. If you need to find me again, I will wait in the Tapster's Tavern off the Commons. There is no better place to hear gossip. Perhaps even word of your victory. Okay then. So this will be a few parts used up for uh, this section of the game, because uh, the Orzmar section is insanely long. Uh, I expect it will probably take me about 20 odd, maybe, nah I wouldn't say 20 parts, maybe 15, 15 I'd say. Yeah, I, I'm trying to think, I don't know, it depends how long. It will take me a while to do, it's a long section. Uh, uh, probably longer than the Redcliffe section. I mean, the Redcliffe section, I don't like counting the Mages Guild quest line. Because the Mages Guild quest line, you know, is technically another quest line and you don't have to do it. So, I'd say this is most likely the longest. It's quite long. Because there's a few different, like, areas and sections and things you have to do. It's a, you know, the ending part is quite, of this quest is quite long. I will not spoil it in case you haven't played it before. Did you speak often with Cain? You're asking me if I have a relationship with my brother, aren't you? Yes. I wonder what he thought of you. Yeah, I have actually got the Platinum Trophy on this game. I don't know if I've mentioned it since. I think, actually, I might not have played this game since uh, I, uh, <laughs> I Platinumed it. Yeah, I have got the Platinum now. If you've got me on PSN, you can feel free to check it out. Yeah, so it definitely took me a while to get that platinum. It was a, it was a trophy. The last trophy I needed to get was one that's uh, relatively tricky. Okay, talk to Basil or Basil. Look, I already told the proving master I withdrew. Do you have to keep harassing me? What are you talking about? That sounded genuine. Um, if you weren't looking for me, do me a favor and pretend I never said anything. Who do you think I'm working for? So I take it you weren't sent here to find out if I withdrew from the proving. In that case, never mind. Okay. Harmon's heard that his own cousin would walk out oh, on him. Don't put it that way. Look, it's just when I was younger, I had a thing with this Idukin girl, Rebelka. Lesser cousin, nowhere near the throne. Her family wanted her marrying up, so they matched her with a BMO. But. We didn't exactly stop seeing each other. Uh, and now Balin's found out? I thought we were discreet, but she's married to a Desher's heir. He'd kill me if he knew. So I have to slink out of here like some worthless brand for fear Balin will tell the whole city. 
Would you? Uh, sorry, give me a minute to look at this. Did Balin threaten you himself? No. One of his fighters, a woman named Miyaja, she's the one who threatened to expose me. What evidence does, does she have? They have letters. Love letters Revelka wrote me. If they were made public, she'd be disgraced. Her husband would cast her aside, and I would be lucky to be allowed to die in a duel. Uh, I can get those letters back. You'd do that? I don't know how to thank you. I, I know it's my own fault, but I'd have married her if I could. If you can make sure that evidence doesn't get out, I'd be happy to fight in the proving. But you need to find them quickly. Registrations close once the first bout starts. Okay. So, I'm not sure if we can get this because I'm pretty sure we need a lockpicking skill. I don't know. This area is off limits. Combatants only. I hear you've been threatening Caramon fighters. Is that an accusation? It's illegal to threaten proving fighters outside the ring. Not helping them keep their dirty secrets, though. That's another story. It's a private matter. You shouldn't interfere. You haven't been here long. You'll learn soon enough. Nothing in Orzammar is private. As long as someone can find out. Come on, Luke John. We have a fight to prepare for. You are quick. You are quickly overstepping. Okay, I think he's gone. Like, can I can I steal things? Or have I not got that yet? No, I can't. Damn you. You are quickly overstepping your welcome. Okay, I don't think I'll be able to get that then. I have to go for the other one then. Uh, that's another one, I think. You new in the fights? I don't remember seeing you before. Uh, are you one of the fighters? Was. Name's Guidon, and I just tendered my resignation. Somehow, I don't think the ancestors will favor me today. Aren't you fighting for Lord Harriman? I fought for House Harriman in the Deep Roads for 20 years, and will again. I don't regret a minute of that service. But it's my family's job to protect this city, not get caught up in political games better left to the noble caste. It's not so much what happened, as what's going to. I heard from a reliable source Lord Harriman's already given up the throne. Thalen called this whole proving to let his lordship save face when he concedes. That's ridiculous. Harriman's isn't conceding. Oh. And where did you hear this that's more reliable than a member of the assembly? Doolin, and I'm rallying honorable fires for Harriman. Yeah. I suppose there's nothing his lordship would do without consulting Doolin. He's always been his top man. Maybe you're right. I I'm just a warrior. I've always tried to stay out of these noble politics. If I find out this whole thing was some flunky of Balin's lying to me for his own gain, I'll... I'll... Get back in the privy and knock some heads. Maybe I will at that. Okay, so we've only only can get the one. Um, you need to have a, you know, you need a um, pick locking skill to get the other. I could, but I get it, but I'd have to go outside, come back in, and it's not worth the fuss, to be honest. I'm just gonna go into it. The proving will begin shortly. I'm sure you can find a place in the stands. Or were you here to take part in the fight? I'd like to fight Lord Harriman's champion. Well, that's a surprise. Never thought the Grey Wardens would take an interest in our king. Let me just put you into the schedule here. Now, is there a particular name you wish listed? I'm Alex of the Grey Wardens. We'll just call you Grey Warden, seeing as those human names are a real bird to pronounce. We actually have an opening in the first round. Are you ready to start? 
ready and eager. That's what I like to hear. I will warn you, though. This is your last chance to make preparations or meet the competition. Once the fights begin, there are no new additions to the roster. All withdrawals are treated as losses and a sign of the ancestors' disfavor. Do you want to start or would you like some time? The fighters' quarters are behind the ring. What are you waiting for? I want to fight. Go down to the ring then. I'll be right there. This is a glory proving. Fought under the eyes of the paragons of Orzammar to honor the memory of King Endrin. First up is Suwern of the warrior caste. Many of you remember when Suwern made history as a lad of 12 by defeating his own father in this very ring. Today, he fights as a champion for Prince Balan. Opposing him in Lord Heramot's name is a member of the famed Grey Wardens. In the name of House Aitukan and our future King Balan. For the glory of Lord Haramon. The first warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! More foes approach. <laughs> And he's gone. My sword is too powerful. The winner is the Grey Warden. That was an exciting start, Warden. Sowern is rarely trounced, and so thoroughly. Are you ready for your next opponent? Yes. Excellent. Let us go. This is a glory proving. Fought under the eyes of the paragons of Orzammar to honor the memory of King Endrin. This round, Paramount's champion takes on the notorious duo. The warrior cast twin terrors now fighting for Prince Balan, Biaja, and Luke John. May the stone honor you. When you fall. Sure, I made the dirt taste good when I feed it to you. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! We will need to fight shortly. Of course. Oh, I'm mean, gonna really enjoy killing this bitch. Oh, yeah, there you go. She's down. Now her brother. The winner is the Grey Warden! That was an exciting bout. Two on one, and you took them both easily. Are you ready for your next opponent? Yes. Excellent. Let us go. This is a glory proving. Fought under the eyes of the paragons of Orzammar to honor the memory of King Endrin. Paramount's champion has held the field so far. But how will he do against one of the legendary Silent Sisters? We'll find out as the Warden faces Lady Hanashan, who proved her worth to Paragon Ashtith the Grey by cutting out her own tongue. The mad bitch. And to our Prince Balin by fighting in his name. Is self-mutilation supposed to frighten me? First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Yeah, these are ridiculously easy fights. The winner is the Grey Warden! Aramont will be pleased, Warden. The Silent Sister's support was a great boost for Balin. Are you ready for your next opponent? Yes. Excellent. Let us go. This is a glory proving. Fought under the eyes of the Paragons of Orzammar to honor 
the memory of King Endrin. This round is paired combat. Just as Kiachet fought as King Bloodlick II, defending our empire, so have dwarves always fought alongside a second. Master of all weapons, prisoner of none, Bojack Ivo has never won the same way twice. What will he do today, lords and ladies? And will it win the day for Prince Balin? Grey Warden, choose your second, for you face Bojack Ivo and Balans. <laughs> 